Becky Spencer, the former Chelsea keeper. A clearance met by the head of Charles. Here's Guro Wrighton looking for Fischl. Good strength from Fischl. She's got support as well. It's James touch for Sophie Ingle. James might make room for a shot here. She has. And Spencer couldn't hold on. She's had to turn it around the post for a corner. Decent effort this from Lauren James. Just not quite far enough in the corner to really worry Spencer. A posse of players ready to break when the ball comes in. Bright always a threat from this kind of situation. Oh, and it's cleared off the line by Molly Bartrip. It might have been Jess Carter who got the touch there. There's a player down in the penalty area, so the game will have to stop. But that's as close as we've come to a goal. Now, who got the touch here? Yeah, it was Carter. Well, this is why you keep a player on the goal line. James. Oh, that's a lovely turn from Neve Charles. Here's James. Good touch from right in. Lauren James. Oh, what a goal that would have been. Hit the stanchion behind the goal in the end. But that was exquisite build-up play from Chelsea. And James almost finished it off. Starting to move through the gears now, the Blues. Reese is here watching on, good to see. Charles got it back from Sophie Ingle. Got a cross in as well. It was a perfect one for Mia Fischel. What a debut. The Chelsea supporter on her Blues bow. Nods Emma Hayes side in front at Stamford Bridge. Just before the half hour, Chelsea had been knocking on the door. And now Mia Fischel has blown it open. The perfect start. Well, she's in for Sam Kerr today, who's not fit enough to feature their big boots to fill. This is the perfect way to go about doing it. What a cross from Charles. And Fischl guided the header into an area where Spencer couldn't reach it. Right. Spence has managed to pinch it back here for Spurs. It's a nice way to pass as well. Chelsea in trouble here. Good save from Musevic. And the follow-up is headed off the post. Right place at the right time, Millie Bright. Martha Thomas denied a debut goal for Tottenham. It's Drew Spence carrying the fight to Chelsea. Great way to pass from her. save was decent and the clearance from the skipper even better Robert Wilhelm will be pretty pleased with what he's seen from Tottenham albeit they trail and they're in trouble here it's James it's off the crossbar Spencer nowhere near it and the frame of the goal comes to Tottenham's rescue How close was this from Lauren James? She's done everything but score so far. Opened her body up beautifully to set up the shot. Nice tee up from Wrighton. Charles. And it's only as far as England initially. Oh, lovely from Fisher. What a goal this would be. Wrighton denied. And Spence hacks it away. Really high quality football from Chelsea. Looking to put Tottenham to the sword at the start of the second half and keeping the pressure on. James into Fischl. Fischl shot beaten away by the goalkeeper. There's Cannering. Oh, it's surely going to be a goal. That looks over the line. Right and celebrating. The play's going on. 
It's clipped back in toward Lauren James and she's going to score anyway. And now it doesn't matter whether the initial effort was over the line or not because Lauren James is off and running for the season. And six minutes after the restart, the Blues have doubled their lead. Well, there could have been a big controversy here. Britton Canridge's header. The follow-up from Wrighton. Well, that looks well over, despite Ashley Neville's best attempts. Wrighton went from celebrating to asking the question to playing on. What a ball from Charles. And Lauren James paying it the compliment it deserved. Two assists for Neve Charles now. And Chelsea with a bit of breathing space. Clinton. Oh, that's a really good hit and a good save from Musevic. Danger's not passed yet. Back in from Ankara James. Here's Neville. And Musevic is behind that one too. And they have looked a threat when they've come forward, Tottenham. Surely ruining the absence of Bethany England. It's a good effort from Clinton, though. And Neville's effort pretty comfortably safe. as ever with their passing here's James Fischel James Fischel Lauren James and Spencer makes the save and Chelsea have played some really excellent football in the second half here and they've come close to scoring two genuinely world-class goals Lauren James makes it look so easy how about me official on debut Here's Naz. Ayan. Simanen. Chelsea, good numbers back defending here, but Tottenham looking to find a way through. Oh, and Musevic has lost it. And Thomas has put it in. And it's game on at Stamford Bridge. Martha Thomas does have a debut goal. And it's not one Zachira Musevic will look back on with much fondness. They managed to keep it alive here, Spurs. The initial effort looked as though Musevic had dealt with it, but it squirmed away from her. And Thomas, like any good striker should, was following up and got herself a goal. Chelsea 2, Tottenham 1. Oh. Is the opening day curse going to strike again? Chelsea hoping not. The other way by Mielder, but only as far as Naz. That's a really good save from Musevic. And Carter did the rest at the expense of a corner. And Naz has really added something to Tottenham's attack since her arrival. She was so close to making it 2 2 here. No sign of Spurs coming here and rolling over. Chelsea closing in on a 13th straight win against Tottenham though. And they might be able to put the cherry on top of the cake here. Chankovic wants it cut back her way. It's Yelena Chankovic. Well, she's celebrating because she hasn't seen the flag yet, but it's not going to count. A shame for the substitute. The yeah, official's in an offside position. And is apparently involved in the play. It is a win on opening night for Emma Hayes and Chelsea. They've beaten Tottenham here by two goals to one. One in either half from Fischl and from James have got the job done. Spurs fought back, but Chelsea held on. Final score, Chelsea 2, Tottenham Hotspur 1. <laughs> 